Yes, we are back. Back again in Train Sim World 4. Back again for another little quick trip. Uh, this time on the Great Western Express line. Where we're in a class 166. 166. Uh, going from West Ealing. Here. Uh, to London Paddington. As it says on the front of the train. I know. Grab that guidebook to me. Probably failing in a 166. And let's go. So hi there, Steve here, and yes, welcome back to Train Sim World 4. If you're new to my content, or even if you're not, then welcome indeed. Uh, this video going out on either a Wednesday or a Saturday, I don't know which. It's going to be one of the two of them. Uh, there's other content from other days uh, from me. Uh, there'll be a link in the description below to where you can get this route for Train Sim World. There'll be a link down there to the Twitch page where you can watch me live on the Twitchy. Uh, six days of the week doing all sorts of things. And a link down there to the Discord server as well. Uh, so yeah, quite enjoying doing these little tiny quick trips. Hopefully you are as well. Uh, so going to take this one from West Ealing all the way into Paddington in the 166. Uh, start of the day-ish, 6.27am. Uh, let's get inside uh, and, well, make our way uh, forwards. So first stop, Ealing Broadway. And then into the Paddingtons. So yeah, uh, just uh, fancy doing some little tiny quick trips. So some of those things that you wouldn't necessarily do on a stream. Because uh, when I do the streams in these, I'm generally doing four line runs. So don't normally do these little shorter journeys. But they are there. Uh, this is a timetabled route on the Great Western Express in the 166. So they are ones if you're going through the timetable and ticking them all off. Uh, this is something that well, you will end up doing. So I thought I'd just do a, an early morning run. I will probably do a couple more of these um, on the channel uh, just to uh, interject them in between the streams so that you'll get a stream, then you get a little short video, then a stream, because as much fun as I enjoy doing uh, the streams, um, I generally do end up just putting them onto YouTube. And sometimes, you know, no one's got the time to be able to watch two and a half hours of me rambling away. So, you know, sort of 10, 15 minute little trips um, we'll try and do uh, a few of them so that there's uh, there's more content because we like content well I do All right 600 yards I can't remember how good the brakes are on this I'm guessing we're gonna find out well anytime soon we got 500 yards to go to Ealing Broadway I don't know where else we're stopping I could have checked but you know quite clearly well I I didn't because this is me isn't that a song from The Great Showman? Uh, right. Brakes are happening. Sort of. Slowly. Right, we are now arriving at Ealing Broadway. And we stop roughly on the mark. That's not bad. Uh, right, unlock doors. Unlock them on the left because that's where the platform is. We unlock them on the right. It's quite a jump over there. That's some camera collision. Thanks for that game. Yep, thank you. Yep, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I hope they sort that out in the next version of Train Sim World. I know it's an unreal thing rather than the Train Sim World thing. But I um, wish there's nothing actually around the camera. There's no people behind me. But it's fairly busy here. Because it would be at half past six in the morning heading into the Landons. From the Burbs. That's definitely a lot of people that are now walking towards my train just as I'm going to need to sort of close the doors get behind the line they're not behind the line they're not behind the line they're, they're the other side of the line they'll be fine all 
Right, next stop. Back to mainline in uh, 1.4 miles. That's not quite two, and it's more than one. 1.4. Well, we saw that other one train. You'd think there'd be more than the one train. That's a picture. That's probably the thumbnail. Because, you know, I'm that organised. I do like a 166. I am a fan. You know, not a ceiling fan or a desk fan. Or one of those little, you know, the wavy hand ones. And what is it with people that have got these little battery operated fans? I saw those when we had the hot weather, you know, the one day of it. People with a little, like, battery operated fan in front of their face. Should, what, should you just moving the warm air towards you? It's like quite weird. Or you see those people that just fan their face with their hand. What's that doing? Anyway, <laughs> Actor Mainline is in point eight of a mile. I do get um, well sidetracked. I think is the word, and not grease is the word. That's a whole different thing. I've got mod in, by the way, for the Great Western Express, which is why you're seeing these overhead gantries. Oh, we're definitely not going to stop now, are we, doing this sort of speed? I barely stopped before. Oh, hang on, it's not a separate brake button. That's full brakes. Uh, that's, that's still full brakes. That's, that's full brakes. Uh, it's fi it's fine. Uh, that's, I could add a win. That's okay. The door the doors are on the platform. It's okay. Maybe not where they should be, but they're all on the platform. And we're only running a couple of minutes late. It's it's okay. It's it's honestly it's okay. Passengers are now being loaded onto the train and unloaded off of the train because that's what they're doing. They're loading the loading on and the unloading of the off. Although no one seems to be getting on or. All getting off. You're on your phone. Lots of people walking the other side of the line. You get shouted at if you did that. It's a bit late. Yeah, we're taking our time to lock the doors. Okay, no locking doors. Okay, oh, final stop. 3.9 miles to London Paddington. Let's go. Oh, I did say it was a quick trip. Okay, two miles. We have a 50 miles an hour limit. I don't think that's going to be an issue, being that, you know, 166. Train, HST. Well, I said actually the 50 might not be an issue, but we, we are accelerating. We're going slightly downhill, but we are accelerating. If we were decelerating, then that wouldn't be great, really, would it?
3.4 of the miles. Nice guy. Don't know why I did 3.4 of him, but, you know. It would be a lot busier than this, in reality. It wouldn't be this quiet as far as the number of trains are concerned. Okay, we're, we're behind something, which is unusual, you know. It's not. There's a train in front of us. Because there was yellows and greens. Not like you get in a packet of fruit pastels. It all tastes the same to me. Right, let's do the slow then, because we've got this uh, 50. Point four miles. I think roughly when this goes on the YouTubes, I've got to think that far ahead now. Shortly after this goes on the YouTubes, I'll actually be doing this journey. Uh, not too far off this time as well. 7 a.m. departure from sunny Swindon to Paddington. That would be on a class 387, though, I think. It's a train. <laughs> not a. 800 thing. Right, London Paddington is in 1.9 miles. We got a 14 mile an hour speed limit approaching. Well, it, it's not approaching us, we're approaching. If it's approaching us, then we'd be stood still and the world would be moving around. And that'd be complicated for everybody. So we're approaching it. But as we are going slightly uphill now, then hopefully our speed will decrease to 40 miles an hour without me having to use the brakes. Now we're going downhill again. No, that's not going to work, is it? Okay, we'll apply some brake. It's fine. I do like the audio going over the points. I do miss the unwelded track. Now we've got continuously welded track. Great for smoothness and stuff, but I do kind of miss the old clickety-clack, clickety-clack. This is the HS2 works going on, I think. Good to see they've got them in here. Right, you've got a 25 limit. Yeah, there would definitely be just a constant flow of trains on this route. But because of licensing, etc., and the timetable that's actually running it, you don't see very many. Shame, really. light to the face. Right, slowlying it down. About 25. There we go. That's the 25 and in we come. Into London Paddington. Very empty looking London Paddington at that as well. There's nobody here. They're all dead, Dave. Everyone's dead, Dave.
Doors are unlocking on the right-hand side of the train. There we go. Uh, we will end there. We arrived quite safely, hopefully, at London Paddington. Uh, give it a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Uh, do hit subscribe to see more from me. There'll be links in the description below uh, to where you can get the route. Watch me live on Twitch and join the Discord server. And yeah, do let me know in the comments if you want to see more little quick early morning trips, etc. Uh, like this from me. Uh, we will end there. Until the next time, if you have been, thanks very much for watching.